I moved out to Vancouver to uh, work in the film industry. Uh, every day I travel downtown for work and often you'll see trailers for movie sets or TV shows that are filming in the area and it's just, you see it everywhere downtown. And Deadpool is probably the, one of the most recent uh, big ones that got uh, a lot of footage here. Uh, X-Men Last Stand, one of the Mission Impossible's uh, more recent ones shot here. Growing up as a child, I, I was always into different kinds of movies and it was actually towards the end of high school that I kind of discovered that there was an option to get into the film industry through animation or visual effects and so I kind of discovered that path on my own. Uh, I became hooked on Batman. Uh, it was the 89 uh, Batman film by Tim Burton actually that kind of really drew me into it. It was kind of dark and different from anything they had seen from Batman before in the movie. Batman vs Superman was uh, by far the coolest project I've worked on. As a Batman fan it was kind of always one of those movies that I wanted to be a part of. As a compositor, we'll take what they shot on set and then whether we're changing the background or whatever, we're adding something to it, Batmobile, I'm the one that combines everything in the end. I've worked on Great Gatsby, Ben-Hur, Men in Black 3. Loyalist was a great foundation. At the time, I wasn't completely fixed on visual effects or animation. So it was a well-rounded course and it kind of led me down a certain path towards visual effects, which I enjoy. And I'm kind of grateful for that because it allowed me to hone into exactly what I wanted to do as a career.